In this video, we will demonstrate how easy it is to access the power and performance of ANSYS Cloud by submitting a batch solve directly from ANSYS Fluent running on a local workstation. We load the case file into ANSYS Fluent and launch the ACT app, making it easy to submit a job to the cloud. When the model is ready to submit, click New Job. Give the job a name. Here it is named Airliner. Pick the closest available data center. Pick the hardware configuration you would like to run on. ANSYS Cloud Secure Data Centers are available worldwide. Let's use a medium configuration, 32 cores in this case, submit the job to the cloud. The input file was encrypted and transferred to the ANSYS Cloud Service. Once the job is submitted, we can monitor job progress from the desktop application or from the ANSYS Cloud Portal. To monitor the job, log into the ANSYS Cloud Portal using a web browser on any device and select the job from the Jobs page. Compute resources are started on demand to service the job. It takes only a few minutes for resources to start up. Then the Fluent job starts, and we can monitor the application as it runs. We have access to the full solver transcript. You notice we can see it either from the desktop application or from the web portal, which makes it very convenient. In addition to the solver transcript, we can also look at convergence graphs to track the progress of the solver as it runs. We can also see job timing information via the analytics view or dig into issues using debug view. We can even view the CPU and memory utilization on the head node of the cluster to get a sense of the load on the compute resources. Returning to the status view, we see that the job is already complete, compute resources have been stopped, and files have been transferred back to cloud storage automatically. We can now post-process. In this case, we have chosen to use the RDP post-process option to post-process in a virtual desktop session using the full power of the desktop software. Like ANSYS HPC, it takes a few minutes for those resources to start. Once they do start, you can connect to the virtual desktop session. Now, launch the Fluent application running remotely on the cloud. It feels like the application is running locally. A single window pops up on your desktop, just like it would if you launched it from your local workstation. Here, we have loaded the results from the cloud. Now, we complete post-processing just like we would on a local workstation. Here, we create a contour plot of static pressure on all the walls of the aircraft. Scale to fit, and there you have it. We are streaming just the graphics to our local machine. This session is remote on the cloud. This other fluent session is local on my desktop. This is the one used to submit the job. You complete your post-processing on the cloud and create any solution artifacts you need. Here, we will save the plot of the pressure contour plot treated on the screen and name it pressure.jpg. Any files that were created during that session are automatically transferred back to ANSYS Cloud Storage. Finally, let's download any post-processing results to our local workstation. Cloud-based HPC can drastically reduce time to solution with no power or throughput limitations. ANSYS Cloud, HPC as easy as it should be.